Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice Diophantin equation. 5ab plus 3a plus b is equal to 15. We need to find all possible values of a and b, where a and b are positive integers. First of all, from these two terms, 5ab plus 3a, we factor out 5a. 5a as a common factor and in bracket left b plus 3 over 5 plus this b is equal to 15. Now because here we have b plus 3 over 5 so we add we add 3 over 5 to both sides like this 5a times b plus 3 over 5 plus b and we add at left side 3 over 5 is equal to 15 and we add at right side 3 over 5. Next 5a times b plus 3 over 5 now from these two terms b plus 3 over 5 we can factor out plus 1 plus 1 as a common factor and in bracket left b plus 3 over 5 is equal to 15 plus 3 over 5. Now as you can see this expression b plus 3 over 5 b plus 3 over 5 is a common factor. So we factor out this b plus 3 over 5. b plus 3 over 5 as a common factor and in bracket left in bracket left this 5a and this plus 1. In bracket left 5a plus 1 is equal to 15 plus 3 over 5. Now because here we have 5 and here we have 5, so we multiply both sides of this equation by 5. At right side we multiply by 5. So 5 times b, 5b plus 5 times 3 over 5, 3 times this 5a plus 1 is equal to 5 times 15 75 plus 5 times 3 over 5 3 now we can write this 5b plus 3 times 5a plus 1 as 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 is equal to 75 plus 3 78 now we have two factors at left side and this 78 can be factorized as 1 times 78 78 times 1 2 times 39 39 times 2 3 times 26 26 times 3 and 6 times 13 and 13 times 6. So we have 8 pairs of factors and we make groups of 2 in each group. This is first case, this is second case, this is third case and this is fourth case. And because A and B both are elements of positive integers, so we must solve all these four cases. First of all, we solve case 1. Case 1. In this case, we write this 5A plus 1 times 5B plus 3 is equal to this 1 times 78 1 times 78 
and in second part of this case we write this 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to this 78 times 1 78 times 1 now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this one and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 78 like this 5a plus 1 is equal to 1 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 78 and from here 5a is equal to 0 and a is equal to 0 and from here 5b is equal to 75 and b is equal to 15 so from here we get the first pair of solutions of a comma b is equal to 0 comma 15 now from here we write this 5 plus a equal to this 78 and this 5b plus 3 equal to this one so 5a plus 1 is equal to 78 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 1 and from here 5a is equal to 77 and a is equal to 77 over 5 and from here 5b is equal to negative 2 and b is equal to negative 2 over 5 so no integer solutions can be found from here now we solve this case 2 2 times 39 and 39 times 2 in case 2 we write this 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to this 2 times 39 2 times 39 and write this 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to this 39 times 2 39 times 2 from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 2 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 39 so 5a plus 1 is equal to 2 and 5b plus 3 equal to 39 from here 5a is equal to 1 and a is equal to 1 over 5 and from here 5b is equal to 36 and b is equal to 36 over 5 so no integer solutions can be found now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 39 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 2 so 5a plus 1 is equal to 39 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 2 from here 5a is equal to 38 and a is equal to 38 over 5 and from here 5b is equal to negative 1 and b is equal to negative 1 over 5 so no integer solutions can be found from here now we solve this case 3 3 times 26 and 26 times 3 in case 3 we write this 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 5 
a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to 3 times 26 and 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to 26 times 3. Now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 3 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 26. So 5a plus 1 is equal to 3 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 26. And from here 5a is equal to 2 and a is equal to 2 over 5. And from here 5b is equal to 23 and b is equal to 23 over 5. So no integer solutions can be found from here. Now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 26 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 3. So 5a plus 1 is equal to 26 and 5b plus 3 equal to 3 and 5a is equal to 25 and a is equal to 5 and from here 5b is equal to 0 and b is equal to 0. So from here we get another pair of solutions values of a b is equal to 5 comma 0. Now we solve the case 4 6 times 13 and 13 times 6. In case 4 we write this 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to 6 times 13 and 5a plus 1 times 5b plus 3 equal to 13 times 6. Now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 6 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 13. So 5a plus 1 is equal to 6 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 13. From here 5a is equal to 5 and a is equal to 1 and from here 5b is equal to 10 and b is equal to 2. So from here we get another pair of solutions a comma b is equal to 1 comma 2. Now from here we write this 5a plus 1 equal to this 13 and we write this 5b plus 3 equal to this 6. So 5a plus 1 is equal to 13 and 5b plus 3 is equal to 6. From here 5a is equal to 12 and a is equal to 12 over 5. And from here 5b is equal to 3 and b is equal to 3 over 5. So no integer solutions can be found from here. So we get 3 pairs of solutions. The first one is 0, 15. second is 5 comma 0 and the third is 1 comma 2 values of a comma b is equal to the first pair is 0 comma 15 and second is 5 comma 0 and the third is 1 comma 2 this is the final answer of this equation